Hello everybody, today I'm going to be showing you how to install the Aether mod along with too many items and Zombies mod pack. I'm not going to be showing the configuration for Zombies mod pack, but I might do that later. But for now, I'm just going to show you how to install it. it. This is going to be for PC, so Mac users... I have a friend who's done a video on it for Mac that I can direct you to. But yeah... First off, you'll need to download, of course, the Aether class. Need to download the Aether class files, audio mod, mod loader, Shaka PI. I'm not entirely sure what that is, but it's one of the requirements. Too many items and the Zombies mod pack. Now then, open up the Start menu and in the search, type percent app data percent and you'll go and open up dot minecraft bin and open up minecraft dot jar this file here with 7-zip winrar one of those nice um One of those nice um archive programs. So now I'm going to open. First, you will need to install Zombies Mod Pack because that needs to go for anything. You can open up class. Just double click the file that says classes. Hide all the files and. Put them in here. Hope it doesn't. I already installed all this, so I'm hoping it won't mess anything up. Next, you'll want to install too many items. Ah. Yes. Now, audio, not audio mod, stupid. Close that. Mod loader's next. And it's really easy because all you need to do is, for the most part, just highlight all the class files and drag and drop them. Audio mod, close. There's a few files in, um, the audio mod, but they still all go in Minecraft.jar. Yes. Shaka PI. And this you'll use bin. Not source. Oh, I guess SRC. That's for modders only if they know what to do with it. And finally, you will install the Aether files. Now, for the Aether files, you have the dot class files along with a couple folders so we've got that whoops I forgot one more thing that you need to do back to the aether go up by one set you back in the original folder and for the resources, you will need to open up, go back to where Minecraft.jar was, and go back to the .minecraft folder. Um, where is it? Open up the resources folder, and drag the file folder mod into here. Yes, merge it. And there you go. That's how you install the Aether mod for Minec for a PC. Now, one thing that you need to do is close Minecraft first, because otherwise it won't let you make adjustments to the Minecraft.jar. But once you've done all this, just log in and play. See ya.